Yes, I would like to save. Things are about to get serious. Didn't work out too well on Iru. Man, do you know how long it took to find all those bugs? Resto change you. <laughs> Stand. But those are hers. Did you honestly mean to take an ancient and withered power like this and turn it against me? You're foolish traitor, Midna. Why do you defy your king? My king, you who do nothing but abuse the magic of your tribe, you have to be joking. How dare you? Are you implying that my powers are old magic? That's a joke. This power is granted to me by my god, the magic of the King of Twilight, and you will respect it. Munch. That looks very painful. My Midna, did you forget? That beast is one of the light dwellers who oppressed our people. No matter how much you may desire otherwise, you will never be more than a shadow in their world. You can't consort with their kind. But... If we can make their world ours, Midna, light and darkness will meet at last. Our tribe will take back their realm, and sweet darkness will blot out this harsh light. And that, Midna, is why. Not just for me, but for all of our people. Lend me your power. So be it. I'll return you to the light world you covet. happy about that. Lanai Lanai probably didn't need the blaster like that. But at least they got us out of there. chosen by the goddesses. Get it a princess locked away in the castle. 
That princess holds the key that can unlock you from your shadow form. It's gonna take a second. We really have to run all the way across that roll. Yeah, it's fine, just gonna move on. Harry. Yep. What's up with the weird blue spot on her right? <laughs> Even bleached a few shadow on her head. Towns people probably aren't gonna like this, but uh, they'll never catch me. They said that there was a passageway in the bar, right? That's where I'm heading first. I just hate the rain, can't get comfortable. Yep. Not the most pressing thing on my mind right now, cat. Fair enough. You there. Thanks for having my back, cat. Oh, you got your paws wet. Your link, correct? No fear. <laughs> Thought so. You can just tell. I'm Louise. You remember meeting me in the shop before? Oh, I don't think we were properly introduced. In any case, I must tell you I'm a bit puzzled as to why you look like that. Really, dear, you can't blame the humans for tossing you out the way you look. Ah, uh, another patient. You certainly are a curious sort. Please. Princess Zelda. This way. Here. Get in through the window. The attic's connected to the castle waterway. It's an old waterway though, so it could be a rough trip. I suppose that's all... I suppose all that's left to do is to make sure that the humans don't notice you. This rain just makes everything worse. Come on. And Agora. You can't get up here. I refuse to believe the Goron climbed up here. Like he can see it, be on guard, maybe even jump a bit, but he's not doing that. Too many pots. We got a lot of pots, honestly. What's up with that? Wait for him to turn around. It's fine. I guess I could have listened to him. Too late now. Heard that an acquaintance of Tal must defeated a beast that's been attacking tourists on the bridge. His name was Link. Sounds as though he brought Telma and her young ward to Kakariko Village. And here I was thinking Hyrule was empty of men of valor. I don't believe he's from Hyrule proper at all. 
My understanding is that he's from the small neighboring province of Ardana. It may sound horribly elitist, but the people do not know the the people who do not know the city simply don't know fear. Right. Not the time to listen to conversations, though. Midna's having some problems. And her first bow! Rip that is soul. Thanks for rooting the roast. Can I call you doggy? I'm Giovanni. Became consumed by greed long ago and sold my soul to a dark creature that did this to me. I can't move. Can't see my girlfriend. My pet cat, Dingle, is frozen on my head. And I don't think I could be more miserable. I have to ask you a favor, doggy. Can you find and defeat the 20 ghosts that lurk in the dark? I think if you can free the pieces of my soul from the ghosts to hold them, I'll be free. But it's raining out, so I don't think you can go outside directly. I'll open the door to the underground waterway for you. Thanks. Once the rain stops, you can come back in here by digging around the front wall where the cats gather. Understand? Right, I'll keep it in mind. I'm mentally preparing to fight the worst culture in the game. No way to go but through. Alright then, motherfuckers. Hey, how much faster you are than me. And how well guarded you are. Good, that one's gone. You're next. Come on. Hate them, hate them, hate them, hate them, hate them. Okay. <laughs> we still need this. Not the time or place, Keys. Hold on tight there, Midna. Here, no problem. Is my throw height higher than I think it is? No, not at all. Oh, I can just go. Cool. These guys need to clear out their sewer. You have a whole civilization down here. That is too much. Been here before. Weird that I can finish pose, but not goblins. Just do me a favor and get off the stairs. Incredible bounce. Something just opened. 
still that weird swingy doorway at the very top. This is connected to the castle, guys. I guess the castle's kind of sort of been taken over, hasn't it? But the standard people are still acting like that's not the case, like the guards. Like, there should either be more proper twilight things up here, which... I don't know what happens to them now that it's not twilighty. Given the intro cutscene, they should still be exactly what they were. Under Zant's command, anyway. Really. Stop jumping off ledges that go nowhere. Try this again. Weird that I can even go over there. Because this is the only time I get to come to this area. And that's like a weird little bonus thing. Lots of skulls. Non-humanoid too. Well... Non-human, anyway. It wasn't exactly a calm ride, was it? Smooth ride? Nice scarf. You tell me, how do we break the curse on this one? He's the one. You need him to save your world. Why, Princess, please? You must help Link. What binds him is a different magic than what transformed him when he first passed the Curtain of Twilight. It's an evil power. Our world is one of balance. Just as there is light to drive away darkness, so too is there benevolence to banish evil. And for the sacred grove that lies deep within the lands, guarded by the spirit Farron. There you'll find the blade of evil's bane, that was crafted by the wisdom of the ancient sages, the Master Sword. The Master Sword is the sacred blade that, can ne that evil can never touch. Me. Evil cloaks you like a veil, and that blade is the only thing that can cleave it. Link, hero sent by the goddesses. Like you, I have been granted special powers by the goddesses. Fine, Link. You can get to the woods on your own, right? Princess, I have one last request. Can you tell him where to find the Mirror of Twilight? Off in the desert. For some reason, we used to execute Ganondorf. Huge mistake, because it's just a portal. Mid, I believe I understand now just who and what you are. Despite your mortal injuries, you act in our stead. These dark times are the result of our deeds, yet it's you who have been made, who have reaped the penalty. Accept this now, Midna. I pass it to you. Uh. 
No, Link, stop her. In fairness, she was just sitting in a tower, playing the part of prisoner. We go back. Back to the woods. Unnecessary backflip. Zelda, I've taken all you had to give, though I did not want it. Big diamond twilight prison thingy. No opening till later. If you think I'm running, you are sorely mistaken. Do you have anything to say? It's deep in the woods, in the sacred grove. Get the sword and let's undo the curse. It's over there. monkey. Oh. Oh yeah, there's a whole thing. I forgot about it entirely. Shit. Oh well, we got mid in the back. Those things were an annoying enemy in the Super Smash Bros game. Here they're just awful. Did you save me? Thank you. Since you're so nice, let me tell you something. There's a really pretty wooded area on the other side of the cliff. I climbed over there, but when I tried to get deeper in the woods, those guys attacked me. What's in there, anyway? Hey, uh, you know... Bunch of stuff. So there's another section of forest beyond the cliff. Okay, let's go. Sometimes you can do nigh impossible jumps. Sometimes you are stopped by very simple ledges. Hooray for wind. Spin again. I know you want to. Who sets up these fucking booby traps? Oh. All the way back here? Really? Seems a little excessive, don't you think? At least she's enjoying herself. Let him pass. 
my depth perception on these things is obviously not quite where I think they are. Let's set this up. Oh, come on. I think that's the Temple of Time, the Light Serenade. Teaching is of old past to you, take sword in hand. Yep. Where the fuck? I don't like that. I don't remember where that is. Is it just in... like... this? And no, it's actively... Is that not just... here though? South of the gate? Or is that north of the river? I hope it's just south of the gate. <laughs> That'd be a lot easier to get to. Use the royal family song. Doesn't sound right coming out of a wolf. Here's your lullaby. <laughs> Nice go, kid. How are you? You seen Tattle? Welcome to the last woods. Complete with the main antagonist, or what could be the main antagonist, of Majora's Mask. Bastard. Well, it's not really his fault. It's the aforementioned mask of Majora. But still... <laughs> for dudes. Problem is it doesn't like give me an obvious thing for it.
No, they just don't stop. Okay. That way's black now. That way's a dead end. Is there somewhere else to go? Yeah, right that way, obviously. Just an idiot. Almost an impressive amount of carnage. Yep. That's a good jump for a duck. Each one of these is the maximum amount of damage I can give to him. Still going strong. I'm glad that Sarius Song has lasted in your heart throughout however much time has passed. But this play shit? Not a fan. Now that way. I'm an adult and fair and I in the Lost Woods, I really shouldn't be here. Turn to skeletons. Which I always took to mean that it's like magical, and it may be, but it could also just mean things kill them. Ah, oh, well. It's okay. I don't have a weird mushroom or a chicken in Kojiro. I'll be fine. I don't care. Should be right next to me. Boss fight time. Yourself lucky I can't jump very well. What if I just point at him? You got anything to say about this? That little. <laughs> Let's get him while he's entranced by that horn. Working on it, but he basically just uses it to summon mobs. A little hard to get him, you know? He's too high. Damn it. There's absolutely a secret to this, and I don't know it. Okay, so it's not damage, it's just gotta touch him. At least I hope that's the case. Simply put, bosses in this game actually utilize health instead of number of hits to them. That's why, like, I spam the jumping attack. I'm 
more puppets. You can put these things in a silent hill game. They belong. <laughs> We done. <laughs> Bye. Yeah. Stay away from masks. Money. Oh, those guys! I remember now. It's a little mini game. Backs, broken backs. Close enough, right? Good intuition from Link Wolf here to be able to figure out oh, just play the melody again. Because whereas that's a major mechanic in the game that that came from, <laughs> not so much here. I can fail at basic puzzles again. <laughs> Guardians of this land, guide us to where we once stood. Only then can you enter the true sacred grove. Beast who speaks our hearts, what do you have of us? Okay, so the guy behind me copies me, and the guy in front of me does the opposite. So let's make it to where I have more room. And then logically I can just have him follow me in here. To an extent anyway. That'd be a nothing jump. This will get him further. I don't think they'll jump off the ledge, right? I just need to be able to go back a bunch of times now. Oh, he won't get out of my way. Okay, well that kind of ruins that, doesn't it? Because I need to go back. And if he won't move, then I can't do that. Reset it. See, I thought I was just going to be able to jump where you are. But, uh, I guess not. So let's offset it just a little more. This should be okay. That lets me buy time. Follow me in.
Nope, I can't. I gotta be able to go backwards and you're not gonna let me move again. I'm just dumb. I admit that I'm an idiot, what's your... <laughs> you don't have a take on this either? I see. <laughs> I may not be the only idiot. I think the concept's solid. I just need to uh, execute it better. I feel like they're exactly correct if they were facing the other way. And by that I mean I had the one on the left on the other side. This may take a minute. Nope, idiot. Squeeze. <laughs> okay. Let's go left first this time. I don't know how much of a difference it'll make. Maybe a bunch. That's still just gonna jump on my head. You're offset by one less than I want you to be. So let's fix that. Go anywhere. I'll produce everything except the correct answer. Just watch. <laughs> and the worst part is, it's not on purpose. <laughs> more down, I think. Everything looks shockingly similar to the start now, but it's not quite. <laughs> One more. Wow. 
I can't go too down. I have fucked this up. Don't yawn at me. <laughs> I'm trying really hard. Thinking really hard. I feel like I was close. And I fucked it up. offset myself by one. Get you both in the corner. <laughs> okay, now you basically have to do that. And now it's the same motion, right? Yeah, I did it. <laughs> Not clean, <laughs> but finished. Good enough for the Temple of Time. <laughs> Go now to the sacred place, beast. We yield passage to the sacred grove. Amaze the sword. Pull it out with your teeth. Nothing against Russell's craftsmanship, but this one's a little better. The sword accepted you as its master. Came with a scabbard, too. This thing is the embodiment of the evil magic that Zant cast on you. Definitely different from our tribe's shadow magic. If you touch it, you'll turn back into a beast. This thing's too dangerous. Probably for the best if we just leave it here, huh? But on the other hand, if we kept it, you'd be able to transform into a beast anytime you want it. Yeah, sure. Since Zant was kind enough to give us to give this to us, we should be thankful and use it all we can. <laughs> if you need it, just call me. I want to keep a low profile, so I'll hide in your shadow when you're human. But I can change you whenever. You be a wolf anytime you like. Also, thanks to this thing, you can warp whenever you want by switching into wolf form. But hey, listen, Link. I got a little favor to ask. Would you mind coming with me to find something called the Mirror of Twilight? It's hidden somewhere in Hyrule. The Mirror of Twilight. Our last potential link to Xant. It's off in the desert. 
The weird circuitous route. I'll be back. I know what's here. Kind of upset I can't access it right away. Bug. Snail. I just gotta warp. Just getting back here later is its own thing. Hey. Okay. That's fine. I will acquiesce. Oh, it's a pout. There we go. Oh, no. A cavern in the forest. I don't like those. Give me back my sword. Let me go. Good guy. So many of them. You want to be included? Start. Better. At least for now. Eventually I'm going to actually start wanting it to be money. You know, whenever we're giving Melo all of our money. So they can spread their enterprise. <laughs> all across creation. I don't want to warp, because I don't have to come back here without being able to warp again. <laughs> Fine. Let's go. Uh... I'm pretty sure that the place to go is Telmus. No, the place to go is south of Hyrule, where that guy is. I'll do that now. Used to that animation. Mr. Postman, you didn't see shit. Letter from Telma. What does it say? Link, there are some folks who want you to meet. Just come to my bar right away. These guys will be powerful allies for you. Come by, I'll be waiting at my castle town bar. Well, I was right. Also, let's not worry about... Can anyone else see this? Because it's the same logic as the Twilight, like, the rest of it, right? So am I the only one that can see a horrible diamond over there? 
probably. A time I'll head to your place probably in the next recording session. Not quite over whatever's head me down. Is it in fact in the water and not over here? That... that sucks. Okay. You want to break things but you need hot spring water to do it, right? You human, yeah, the one the Gorons told me about. Take a look at those rocks. Was there a landslide or something? What are you doing here anyway? Trying to pass through? If I drink some hot spring water, it might give me the strength to break through. You find some, come see me. It doesn't survive warping. And the only way to do it is to rebuild a bridge on the eastern side of Castletown. Through Melo Mart, of course. Or I guess you could just buy it from that guy. But that's no fun. As of now, I have two bugs at my castle. We need 22 more until all of them are here. Do your best to find partners for the ones that are not paired up already. Big hole in the water. Or earth. It leads to the water, which would take me to Lake Hylia, which is technically where I need to go, but I don't think I know it yet, so I can't do it. I think I'm gonna see. Like, do this. Teleport to Kakariko. See if Melo is getting donations yet, and then that'll be it. The greatest of the hidden skills I've taught you to this point. Let's do it. Do you know how to backslash? Oh, awesome. Hey, look at this sword. Here's a certainly capable performing my lost art. Four of hidden skill. Helm splitter. Stagger. Then jump attack. That thing I keep doing anyway. It's impossible if it it is impossible to circle around to perform a backslice against fully armored enemies that move swiftly. Against such foes, you must first use a shield attack to make them flinch and then quickly press A. You leap into the air over the enemy's head and greet them with your blade by immediately striking from behind. Ignore the fact that you need like a seven and a half foot vertical to do this. This is the helm splitter. Show it to me. Bonk. Impressive. Don't miss your chance to land a Helm Splitter of A after your shield attack. The fourth hidden skill has been passed on. And it'd be really useful against Dark Nuts. There are still three hidden skills. Don't neglect your dailies. There's that one in Lake Hylia that I could actually access now. That I can climb a ladder. Here. Let's... Let's try to solve as many small things as possible. I heard a bug, by the way. I don't really care about that right now. I think I'll just... Do a concentrated bug hunt some other time. If, in fact, ever. Because, what, you give her all the things, then she gives you a bigger wallet. Bigger wallet is useful, but at the same time... You don't need it.
He can't get any spring water. He just sits outside the eastern gate. Ah, so he doesn't sell things until after that, which is why you have to do all this. Fair. You should be fine. Kakariko. Before we freak out Taylor, who's on watch? Eh. It is a boomerang capable thing then. Hooray. Nice to see you out. Thought the Zora boy had gotten better, but he's been really depressed lately. He doesn't try, try to make friends with anyone, and every day he just gets up and goes straight to the graveyard. We'll deal with that later. Wah, wah, wah. Long ago I predicted you would come. Why did you did you not see young Goron in trouble in Castletown? I would go to his aid in a moment, but with that bridge still needing repairs, it is impossible. Perhaps his fortunes will turn, for it looks like the Malo Mart is raising money to repair the bridge. This is a fine thing. Might you consider a contribution to their fundraising? Please. <laughs> Not so secret plot to control the world, eh? Even got the Gorons in on it. Heard from a reliable source, the shops in Hyrule Castle Town are gouging prices, crushing folks under the thumb of commerce. Yeah! Repair the broken bridge. Yeah! Buy the Castle Town shops. And since we have all the money, we don't need to worry about prices. Thousand rupees short. I'll give you thirty fifty. The Melo Mart is, in fact, now looking for money. Which gives me something to pour money into. I don't think I have anything that'll help progress the Sora Kid storyline. I may, if it's the armor, but I don't think it is. I think I gotta go there. And get other stuff, but I'm not quite there yet. Let's say hi to him. And then... I think I'm gonna head to Zora's Domain slash Upper Lake Hylia and get that warp point, so that way I have it. There's also... no, there's not. There's also the uh, Howling Stone and lower like highly that I need to deal with. Is your name Link? My mother came to me in a dream, showed me your image. I spoke of a youth who would save her domain and steer my fate, one named Link. I must thank you for all you've done. If there's anything I can ever do for you, please tell me. Please. Well, there's not yet, just uh, look away. Zora's Domain, go down. Do the riverboat thing to go down even farther. Yeah, they don't care about magically appearing ones. They are simply beyond fright. Nobody's looking this way, right? Is 
There's also that passageway. Yeah, I'm not too concerned about it right now. I believe that if I'm human whenever I do this, then I get a free round of the thing. Which may be part of the reason why I'm going here first. But now that we're in this part of the game, it should spawn, right? Customer, we're temporarily closed. Why are you closed? Why are you closed? Hello. You said it. How's the Master Sword feel? Hooray! You sure you're still closed? That scared me. Who are you? Looking to keep your cool fighting monsters like that? It's happened a few times. What a champ! What are we standing around for? Come inside. <sighs> Golly. Talk about scary. I thought I was done for. Things have been getting pretty crazy around here, let me tell you. Thanks for earlier. My name's Isa. I rent boats here. I used to rent boats here, and then we had a rock fall and then damn the river up. He's a helpful guy at times like this. And you guys sure be a big help. Oh well. Story of my life, not much I can do but come visit Nathan. Just so bored. Need someone, anyone. You're a lifesaver. Just bomb arrows, let's go. Free bomb bag, that's the secret reason why. Pep fight, let's go. Oh, I gotta shoot it from here. Yep, 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 yep. More than one shot. I feel like you could have done that yourself. What if you were a bunch of bombs? You did it. My guy tells me there is still some rocks blocking the way along the river, so you should take care of those too. There's the boat. It's a teensy bit dangerous, so don't leave the boat. One of our part-timers is waiting down there, so you can get the details from her. And when you're done, you can keep that bomb bag and everything in it as a token of my appreciation and everything in it. We will not refill it. Bye. Clear rocks. Don't die. <laughs> This is gonna hurt. Why is it on X now? Who put it over there? Just little gems. I don't need them right now. We. <laughs> This is not safe. Blah. Hi. Come at the request of the shop owner, haven't you? 
I'm an air employee, part time for now. Sorry we troubled you. These rocks are blocking the natural flow of the river. All you need to do is use your bomb arrows to destroy the blockage. Again, y'all could have just done this. You have a Zora in your employ. They're like immune to water. Water's already begun to flow. I shall guide you to the mouth of the river. I'm not in control of this thing. Like, I can almost sort of kind of hope to go in a certain direction. <laughs> That's about all I've got. Relatively money rich experience if you aren't awful. Or, you know, subject to tides. Come on. <laughs> Why would you leave me directly into a thingy? I do recall it being slightly easier to control later. <laughs> but never very easy. <laughs> Is that the two total blockages? I got a bomb bag out of it, so I guess I can't complain. And you just somehow get the boat all the way back upstream on your own. Good job out there. Truly done us a great service. Now the shop can finally reopen. When we were closed, my boss's temper only got worse and worse. It was, it was pretty rough for everyone. Another thing. I don't suppose she promised you anything special for doing this, did she? Just a bomb bag, right? It's just to bribe people with whatever's lying around. It's okay. I'll let her know you kept it when I get back. Bombs. Now if you'll excuse me. Come visit the shop sometime. Is that taken care of? I wanna I wanna get the paling stone before I deal with the bird. I will be dealing with the bird. But just a minute. Master Sword's most destroyed opponent, Grass. Every hero that's ever wielded it uses it to cut grass. And it does so wonderfully. <laughs> Surmountable blockage that was a ladder. That looks spooky. Are you a deep cave? Yeah, I don't want to deal with that right now. Let's get the thing. like a Poe. Looks a lot like a Poe. Got a howl.
This one's kind of long. Down, middle, up, down, middle, down, up. Yes, I missed it somehow. Probably too much on the second down. Now you're going to go... <coughs> Here! Outside the bounds of the map. Great job. Okay. Let's do the bird activity. And then I can call it a night. excited about the latest attraction down here at the lake. Want to hear about it? Popping balloons as you move toward the goal. The balloons are worth different amounts of points. Watermelon 1, orange 3, strawberry 10. If you break the same type of balloon twice in a row, you get double the points, but only up to 10 times. If you hit a wall and fall off, then you get no points. You know, you get something neat if you get over 10,000, right? Not that you ever will. The game starts as soon as you fly in the air. I think the thing to do is to just get strawberries and only strawberries. Get more things only up to 10 so a watermelon can only be worth 10 at max. Getting to 10,000 in intervals of 10 is nightmarish. Hello bird. Really, this is mid in a play. Because Wolf Link has no control over anything happening here. No amount of timer, so I can just do whatever. And as we learned the first time, if I just go slow, it's better. Ouch. Don't touch the watermelon, they are stinky. Strawberry. That's a bunch of strawberries. <laughs> I mean, there's no reason to dash. Oh, I'll be honest. Don't touch that watermill. What the fuck? How did I miss the strawberry? Fuck it. Hopefully it's not as tight as it could be. Oh, it's multiplicative. H. Bleh. Not good. Everything's fine. <laughs> Don't touch the watermelon. Got it. 
Ouch. We're okay. This is just style points at this point. And I fucked it up anyway. Okay, I don't even get the final reward if in fact there is one above the 10,000 point minimum. You can easily get like 50k. Because I think I missed four. No way! 30,731 points? You got more than 10k. Take this. I don't think I'm giving you this because I like you. You're completely hooked now. You need to go again and try to beat the high score now. Thank you for the free game, bird. I have done what I needed to do. And since I'm here, I may as well see if I can do this thing for, like, points this time. Not that I remember what you have to do in order to do this one well. Welcome. I see you were back in business. Can't offer much, but just make yourself at home. And of course, if you want a boat ride, let me know. Pats. Must not destroy. What's the thing? If you hop on a boat, you can ride all the way down to Lake Hylia. Blow up any of the targets posted around with your bombs. The targets just look kind of like jars. Greens are worth one, red are worth two. If the boat hits anything, you lose the point. Get 25 for a prize. Sure. I can fail. So just shoot everything. Because there's no like multiplicative. It's just things are worth a thing. And be careful about getting bonked. That's bad. I kind of sort of can't see past the bomb. <laughs> Above 20, so I need to be careful once I get 20. I may just stop shooting and focus entirely on dodging rocks. Seven. In between seven and thirteen more. Without bonking anything. Important distinction. I wonder if the, she just has it to where hitting the boat takes away points because the boat was getting wrecked by people in the past. Like me, now. Well, I guess now the question is what's the maximum point value? Which means, really, how many times can you get bonked? Yeah. Shit, fuck. I'm going backwards. <laughs> I fucked up. <laughs> Don't narrow. Okay. Two left. Focus. Come on, janky ass controller. I need you. 
Ow. No. <laughs> you screwed me. Eh, uh, maybe not. Stay straight. That's all I ask. Ooh, there is really not all that much wiggle room, is there? I bonked a few times, but that puts the max, what? 28? Unless I missed any jars. Which, I don't think so. Thanks for your patronage. Score 24. If you'd gotten 25, I'd given you a prize. I thought it was above 20. 25. You did screw me right in the end. You bastard boat. <laughs> It's the lake is hard to control. Lake can't even control the lake. The boat's hard to control. The river makes it hard to control. This shit happens. You end up going full speed at a 90 degree angle. Why did I think it was 20? Gotta be careful. Don't touch it. Get off the side. Focus. <laughs> Eep. Go to the right this time. But to the extent that just get through there and then reverse shoot these things. Alright. So I'm not completely incapable of learning. I'm just dumb. <laughs> There aren't any on the left there, are there? That's just somewhere you don't want to be. Okay. Good to know. Speaking of going left, please! Eh. Okay. It's only one. We're still on this. I bonked a lot last time. Only missed it by one. So, we're still ahead. Okay. Pilot. Yeah, assuming I got them all, there are only 30 points possible. That's boat. That boat is difficult to control. Like, it's a lot of, oh god, please, please, and it not doing anything. Twenty-five for something useful, and then thirty for bragging. Got twenty-eight points. As the first customer to score at least twenty-five points, you receive the prize. A big bomb bag. 
Can I get any time? Now does that effect? Now, now is that an upgrade to one of my existing bomb bags or its own bomb bag? I don't know. <laughs> But, okay. Next time, I'm gonna head to Telmas Bar and maybe get ourselves shot out of a cannon. I think that's how that works. I don't however remember if you need like a special thing to do so. Something involving this cannon made me very lost for a very long time. I think it may have been the Sky Temple. But okay, that's it for now. Till next time.